Hey guys, my name is Moon and welcome back for more Aiden Chronicle Rising. So we are on a quest to fix the clock tower, right? And we need to talk to people first. So let's talk to this lady right here, Pretza. What do you have for me, Pretza? You're a Pretza, right? Is Awamori home? Of course he's not. Day in, day out, that old lout just drinks himself silly and never comes home. I'm finished with him. If I ever see him again, I'll string him up uh, with the ease by his underwear. Eves? What is Eves? Whoa, let's take a breath, Preta. No good drunkard. That's too good for him. I kind of need him alive, though, at least for now. I have something I really need to ask him, so do you have any idea where he might be? Uh, I should like to know myself. I'm guessing you already checked the tavern. Yep, I did, and uh, nope, he's not there. Any other ideas? Maybe he's finally sober up then. In hiding is my guess. He knows what's in store for him when he comes back. He doesn't have the guts to step outside of town either, so he must be around somewhere. Like I said, he's probably in hiding. This wasn't as helpful as I hoped. Okay, thanks. I'll go look for him, or for his hiding places. I'm not angry at you. If you find him, just tell him to come home, okay? And if he actually comes home? I'll string up by the eaves of his underwear. He ain't coming home now. Got it. I'll let him know. Find Awamori. Um, how do we know where this person is? Rune quarter? Awamori. You're not that person. Here. Oh, is that him? Awamori, I finally found you. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Don't tell him I'm here. If you don't want me to tell Preta where you are, answer some questions. Sound fair? Anything. Go ahead, ask me anything. So when the clock tower fell after the earthquake, did you see anyone take an iron-looking thing around this big from the plaza? No, I don't know about that. Not me. So you didn't see anyone pick up anything. You know, the last time I woke up in a plaza in the dead of night, I might have seen someone with something shiny. Hmm, shiny. What did they look like? I was half asleep. Besides, the only light was the moon. I couldn't see them clearly. So you got to remember something. If you don't, I might just have to pay Preta a visit. Skinny. He was skinny and he had a feather on his head. Oh, is it squash? A feather like on a hat. It might be, have been a hat. His head was a funny shape though. I don't remember him having a neck. Skinny with no neck. Was he wearing a scarf by any chance? Yes, his neck looked fuzzy alright. And I think he had something in his mouth. A pipe perhaps? No, it was sharper than that and pointed downward I think. And when he took the shiny thing, his eyes got all shiny too. I know. I think I know who it might be. Thanks, Awamori. Don't tell Preta where I am, okay? I've got nowhere else to go. She asked me to tell you to go home, but apart from that, I'm staying out of it. She asked you to what? She said she won't be mad, so you should go home. But if I go home, she'll... String up your eaves by your underwear. Yes. He's gonna hide again. I'm not going home to that. I guess so let's talk to our feathery friend, right? Where is he? Hogan. I wonder if Hogan is going to be like a playable character on uh, the next game, right? On 100 Heroes. Squash, maybe? Squash, do you take any... Or do you take a shiny thing from the plaza a while ago? You done your research, I see. A fragment of astralacrum splintered off a gear, so I added it to my collection. I knew it. The gear fragment from the clock tower. We can't fix it without that piece. Can we have it just as it is? Hmm, is that so? Very well. Only fair to return it. Thank you. I owe you big. I might not part with it for anyone else, CJ. Apologies for inconveniencing you. We did it. We got it. 
Okay, Tatara is in. He's right here. Tatara. Tatara, I've got what you need. We found it. Nice work. I'll start casting right away. I'll have to start with the crucible, so come back in four or five days. Got it. Thanks, Tatara. That's a long wait. Four or five days. Hi, Tatara. Is the gear ready? Sure. And not bad for my first time casting, if I do say so myself. You're my hero, Tatara. I can't thank you enough. Oh, stop. Besides, it was pretty fun to try casting. I think I can expand my services thanks to you guys. If you need anything else cast, just let me know. Will do. We've got all we need for now, but if anything comes up, we'll swing by. Okay, Shiva. Can we finally go in? Shiva, the gear is ready. You little star. With this, we can finally finish renewing new Nivea's pride and joy. I was sure I was wrong. I mean, to treat you so poorly, CJ. You're a good person. Here, take a stamp. The men here? Now, we can finally head to the bars beneath the town. Took long enough, didn't it? So, come on, let's go and right, get this show on the road. Isha? My father uh, made a deal with the Empire and put the town folks in danger by dragging them into the borrows, all for my sake. I put the people of this town through so much. Can I ever make it up to them? Isha, listen. Doc said did everything he did to save his little girl. Now that the little girl will have to pick up where he left off. Besides, you already have. Who else could have kept this town running like clockwork since Doc said disappeared? I shudder to think what will become of this place without you. So, if it's a town you're worried about, then go smash that shigil to bits and free yourself from this blasted blessing. Shiva, thank you. He gave me a stamp. You will not be able to return to town or use signposts from this point on. Proceed. Um, no, no, no. Um, stove pack. We got a lot of potions, right? Are we good? Storehouse. Okay, I think we're good. We'll just go. So we're in the end game. Okay. How long is this gonna be? An hour? I'm glad to hear you saying nice things for a change, but do you think you could get this gear in place for us? Right away. Give me a hand, will you? It's huge. I got it. Right then, use the pulley to drag the weights up. My arms are already ready to fall off. Hey, this one? Okay. Here we go. Oh, it's moving. The weight is rising. I should uh, hope so, mate. Uh, it's working, all right. At this rate, the weight uh, will reach the bottom in about four days. Sounds about right. If memory serves, we used to wind up it up every four days or so back in the day. Didn't you say we'd have to ride the weight down to where the lens fits in? I did. So are you telling me it'll take four days? Don't be silly. There's a maintenance lever that'll take you right down. Oh, good. What are you waiting for? An invitation? Hop under the weight and get going. Got it. Okay, I thought we were actually going to wait actually for four days, right? Just got to pull this lever and you'll be away. Watch out, CJ. I don't want my friends to get hurt. No worries. Just a short trip down, isn't it? Ready when you are, Shiva. Oh, is, is only CJ going down? It is a big puzzle. It's here. The lens can fit in here. All right, men here. I need to help my friends. So wakey, wakey. It worked. Now to solve this little riddle. Oh, it's automatic this time. Yes, time to smash the sigil up good. 
So we didn't have a last puzzle for this. I mean, I guess the last puzzle we had last episode was kind of hard, right? Shiva, why are you here? Hey, you know, it's because he was near the men here too. This just gets better and better. Uh, are you hurt, Shiva? It's kind of dangerous though, right? <laughs> because yeah, he's fragile. That took years off and what just happened? I should have said something, Shiva. Anyone near the men here gets pulled in through it. I didn't think. Uh, so that's how it works, is that right? So I'll have to stock up on shiny black eggs to get those ears back. The shiny black eggs. Hold on, are we in the borrows? Well, I never. This is... You guys have uh, had this place all to yourselves all this time? He's changed his tune. Amazing what a change in perspective can do, ain't it? Well, it's quite striking when you see it in person. So, uh, what do we do about Gramps? Can't drag him along behind us, can we? Even if we wanted to send him back, I don't see a man here around here. So we can hardly leave him here. He'll have to come along. This just gets better and better. Oh, we got a new secret character. Shiva. Imagine that. Okay, let's go. Where this all began. Okay, let's do this. He's so excited, he's going much faster than us. Well, 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 what have we here? Shiva, please refrain from touching anything. Who knows what could have happened? It looks like uh, a lot that other room we saw. Another one of the sorcerer's labs. Whoa, a raw lens. Seen better days, hasn't it? Dim, dirty. Think it's broken? It's lost its power. It looks like it was used to power up a rune lens. So it's just a shell. Great. Oh! Father? Doxa. He's, he's lived. No, that's fake. That's a hologram. That humongous lens. Honestly, I want to see what actually the lens looks like. We can't really see them, right? It worked. All those are all lenses from the monsters in the room and their power. It's working. Finally, through transmutation, I can turn these raw lenses into something greater. The worms that populate Nevea are just as worthless as the cattle that came before them, but in greater numbers. If every one of the worms were to produce a raw lens, I might have enough magical power to learn about the truth of the rune barrows. If not, I'll just wait for new worms to seep in and do it all again. Yeah, he's dancing, right? It's gone. What are you doing, Doxa? Did he say he wanted a raw lens from every one of the worms? He did, and I think I finally get it. His plan was to empower the sigil using that humongous lens, then curse the whole town with this borrow's blessing. That dirty no good. You think I'm just gonna let you blame me like that, do you? It's clear now, that is not my father. Isha? That evil sorcerer cursed my home. Or, ah, that is the evil sorcerer, so maybe he's just controlling the body, right? Like, Daxa is really gone now, but the body... Maybe he's possessing the body or controlling the body, one of the two. And when I find him, I'll put an end to this for good. We have to act fast, the sigil must be destroyed. Because you can see it in the diary, right? He was very... He really, yeah, he loved his daughter. And he was, he's not gonna do that. Like what he's saying here, right? He's calling the people worms and stuff, right? So that is a sorcerer, the evil sorcerer. 100%. Anyone who gets in our way can meet the same end. Destroy them, destroy them all. Now we're talking. Anyone tries to stop us, you leave him to me, mate. Isha, I'm sorry. I had no idea it would end like this. You did nothing but say... True to your word, CJ. I am grateful. Truly. 
So will you help me one last time to finish what my father couldn't? Do you even have to ask? Let's do it, Isha. Okay, let's do it. Where are we? Okay. Big, big place. Are we going to fight a boss here? There's a big room is what I'm saying. Oh, we're going to fight these guys. Who are they? Lens bandits. I thought you all gave up and ran away. We haven't heard from you in quite some time. I couldn't help but feel like perhaps my presence was required. That enormous lens is up ahead. Is it not, Guru? Oh my god. Why is Guru working for them? And who's he? An imperial dog. Oh, maybe just Guru knows him. Same as me. I must thank you young ladies for assisting my compatriot. As your services are no longer required, I shall permit you to jo join your fallen Nivean brethren here among the rubble. First one, I presume, and the Imperial who made a pact with my father. Is the Empire in the habit of sending rogues to cause trouble in neighboring territories now? Tax evaders, no less? I thought an Empire would at least show some semblance of dignity. Have you no shame? How dare you? Uh, oh, I don't know. Riding on coattails and taking what's not yours. Sure sounds imperial to me. Not big and bald enough to come get your own treasure, no. A leech is all you are. I will not be spoken to by some lowly or stained street urchin. Garou, take care of these savages at once. Have your ears steeled up, beast men? Or have you forgotten about your poor daughter? Shall you let her suffer as your late wife did, rich enough for treachery, are we? Oh, so maybe they kidnap his daughter, that's why. Oh my god. Eliminate these gutter snipes and go fetch me that enormous lens. Me? Disobey me and I take your daughter's life for sickness as the chance. Oh, do you ever shut up? If you want to punish me, you're free to try your luck here now. I'll have your head back uh, to your mates, or a head back to your mates, before you get anywhere near my alibi. Alibi, alibi, wallaby, attack. Here we go, it's battle time. Oh, you got a kukri. Isn't that a kukri? Like in other games, it's called a kukri, right? All your homies are gone, sir. Okay, you got some reinforcements. You're too weak. You cannot do damage to me. Kill him. Kill him. Easy. Curse you. You're nothing. How all you want on the other side. Oh! I can't see a thing. Use a flashbang. We're gonna see that guy again. What was his name? I didn't actually see his name. Damn it, did he get away? Guru! Are you sure you want to stay here? No, I was, I'm, I'm, I was not looking at the name. I was just looking at the dialogue. I can't fight tooth and nail to save my own kid, just to let you and the kids here die. We'll end this together, and then I'll go get my alibi and bring her here. Just say the word and you'll have a home here in Univea. My boy has another rental house you can have. Priya will be happy to have a new friend. I hate to impose, but alibi, so alibi is the actual name, okay? He's sick and the air here is so clean and the hot springs and... I don't know how long she's got left, but I just want her to enjoy it. Her sickness can't be healed? The doctors all, all said it's too late for that. Got a couple of years left at best. When all this was done, I was out. That was the plan. Take the money and run. 
But I shouldn't have lied to you. Guru, worry not for you. We would never have made it this far. She's right. What's with you getting all guilt ridden all of a sudden? You think you've got room for one more, Isha? I think I'd like to stay here myself. Of course, how foolish would I be to force a friend out? I never thought uh, I'd have one, let alone two. Well, there won't be much town left for us to live if we don't destroy that sigil. Let's go. That's nice, very wholesome. What about me? You are a friend too, Shiva. Yes. Even Shiva saying, yes. Why USS? Oh, the final battle this time. The final, final one. Let's do this. So I assume we're gonna fight something else again. This is potion. Oh hell no, I should have used my potion here. My bad. This looks like the innermost chamber. I can feel magic energy pulsing from the other side. The sigil is in there for sure. So this is it, huh? Might want to run a last minute gear check before we barge in. I, I won't be much use in there, so I'll wait here. Don't keep me waiting though. You come home now, all three of you. Home. Okay, sir. No problem, sir. Is it gonna be a big golem or what? Oh, it's actually him, the one we're following. Yeah, Doxa. Or I guess his body. Hey, fake mayor, think you're clever, do you? We got you now and we know who you really are. Oh, he's actually talking. Show yourself. I didn't come all this way to be ignored, mate. Isha. Stop this, scoundrels. Father is trying to save town, okay? So please, you have to trust me. Shut up! Isha, stop! Shut up, you monster. Yeah, he's just pretending now. You call me a monster? You who would murder your own father? Look upon your monstrousness, his bloodied bone, his broken bones. Your beloved father. Oh, and look, his arm got actually broken. Ugh. I didn't even notice that. He was in a much worse condition when I found him, of course. You. You're a monster, all right. Damage his body all you want. I feel nothing. You cannot hurt me. It's a big one. I'm ready, CJ. Guru, don't hold back. So the worms have turned. Very well, it's too early to harvest you, but I'll let you entertain me for a while. Then I'll dismember each of you and pull raw lenses out of your lifeless husk. Here we go. Oh my god. Die! Blocked it. I need Guru can move. Oh 
930 damage. Yeah, you can't really charge when you're burned like this. Do it! One more! I like the charging. Bye bye. Father, I have avenged you. We did it. Isha. Oh no, is she gonna die? Dude, don't, don't tell me she's gonna die here. There's life in him yet. Oh, he's alive. How fun. I haven't enjoyed myself this much in 300 years. What's happening? His power is increasing exponentially. You animals have freed me of my physical form, so now I can be so much more. I never imagined a simple soul extraction could give me so much power. Gather my failed experiments. Those who died here needlessly come to me and feed my power. What is this second phase? We got a second phase. It's massive. Twist my limbs and spill my guts all you can. I cannot die. Wouldn't you rather just join me? I mean, yeah, this is good though. At least there was a second phase. I thought that was the boss and it was finished. It was so easy. Well, so these are the people he killed back then or died here, I guess. Shoot him! Shoot, Isha, shoot! The chill is annoying though. We cannot deal any damage to this thing. Oh my god, we did it. Mo, that is his true form. You fools, you are but worms. Even if you defeat me, the sigil will live on. The spell will continue. Anyone who dares set foot in Nevea will but father for my ambitions. Just die, sir. Isha, now. Be gone. My time is up. This is the end. He's back to his normal. Oh, he's a disappearing. But then maybe he's still alive though, right? I can I can honestly feel it. Because why make a prequel and then you have your last boss, right? He's gonna come back for sure. Maybe. I'm like 50% sure. That'll come back to the other game. The sigil won't stop. It doesn't work. We gotta run. It's no use. What can we do? The rune lens. We have to destroy it. It's powering the sigil. 
But that's what he came here for, right? He need a treasure to take home. I already got what I came here for. Yeah, you got friends. That is much better than treasure. You, Garu, the townsfolk, and you, Nevea, is my treasure in my home. Ain't, there ain't no bigger treasure than that, Isha. Garu, you with me? CJ. Till the end, mate. Full power. We won some weeks later. Just time skip instantly, right? Do you think Garou was able to get to Alibi in time? Can you believe he just ran off with a, without as much as word? He didn't even tell me where the treasure was. What kind of treasure hunter just leave their partner high and dry? Calm down. The most important thing is that both he and Alibi return safely. Of course they will. Just watch. You'll see. So we'll see his daughter. He'll bring her here. Um, I meant to ask, but how are you doing? Well, destroying the sigil didn't do much about the raw lens inside me. Upon inspection from various sources, it becomes attached to several vital organs. Too dangerous to remove. Right. I know not when this lens will choose to end my life. But until it does, I intend to be the best, uh, the best mayor I can possibly be. That sells it. I've got my next mission. We, you and me, are gonna find a way to get rid of that raw lens. Now that's a town's budget books are nice and balanced. Gokto and Shiva can take care of that stuff. There ain't no treasure I can't find, so leave it to me. Well, uh, we'll cure poor little Alibi and find a way to deal with a lens. A scavenger's honor. You with me? Time spent with friends is to be treasured, I suppose. And I would like to see some more of the world. I'm with you, CJ. But I'll find what I need myself. I can rely on you for everything. Whatever you say. Hogan. Honestly, I thought Hogan would have a big part in this game. But, yeah. Re nothing really. Only in the beginning, right? He was just a shopkeeper. How are you doing, ladies? Miss Mayor, I got a question. If you don't mind, a merchant swung by earlier to deliver a letter. I ain't never heard of no one by the name of Crown Jewel, though. You got any idea who that might be? Crown Jewel? Shh, not so loud. What in tar- Don't tell me CJ- Why isn't her name is Crown Jewel? Are you serious? Short for Crown Jewel? Well, so what if it is? There's not even an actual name though. Excuse me, it's suitable for a scavenger. Yes, very shiny. No, seriously though, I mean, yeah, they're scavengers. So I guess that's why, um... She was named the Crown Jewel. It's not a name I'm lucky to forget, that's for sure. Our little Crown Jewel. Not a word, Zagoro, you got that or I'll kill the both of you. Not like I can do much about it. My family names are... All of your kids are after treasures, so if you must know. That explains the sender's name being Gold Digger. I suppose... Oh my god. Crown Jewel gets a letter from Gold Digger for a spell I thought the young youngins were playing a prank on me. My dad, his name is Gold, Mr. Gold. I sent him a letter along with my stamp card. Told him the stamp card was a treasure I'd found on my right of passage. I guess this is his reply. Oh, what did it say? To my lovely Crown Jewel. First things first, I owe you an apology. That raw lens I said I found in my rite of passage, it's fake. We've had it in the family for years. It's a what? Don't be too angry about it. The rite's not really about a treasure in that sense. It's about learning what's important to you. In my case, a treasure I found was your mom and then you. The gift that kept on giving. 
From what I read in your letter, it seems like you've done pretty well yourself. You made your old dad proud, sweetheart. Whenever you feel like coming home, we'll be right here. No matter how far this world takes you, you'll always be my pride and joy, my priceless treasure. Lots of love, gold digger. He's gonna cry. Wait, that's it? That's it? We didn't even see Garou come back? Are you serious? That's it? That's the ending of this game? Okay, um, my score for this game is... I'll give it a... Uh, 7.5 for me. Yes. 7.5. I Honestly, I enjoyed the combat. The best thing about this game, combat... I loved it. Yeah, I, I haven't played a game in like this in a long time. I keep saying that when we first began, or first began as Let's Play, but seriously though, I really love the combat though. Like in the beginning, it was kind of hard, but then as you go through this game, you'll get used to it, and it's nice. You just keep spamming, right? You do link attacks, and yeah, my favorite one actually is Isha when it comes to doing magic damage. I really like her. Her battle style, I mean. For the characters itself... Yeah, I didn't like them though. CJ, Isha, Guru... I like them. We, we we didn't really see a lot of the different characters, right? But those three... Yeah. Very nice. And then they had some wholesome scenes. Especially here in the ending, right? So for... What else? Grinding? Grinding was okay, I guess. Quests are kind of bad because it's quests were pretty much just fetch quests like most of the time like 90 percent of the quests were just yeah fetch quests so it's, it's it's okay i guess at least it was fast to do i mean yeah it's very fast to do it's unlike other games that it's fetch quests but it might take it 30 minutes because of the battles right but here the battles are fast so it's easier to get it's easier to finish so that was okay so the only things I didn't like here is uh, the beginning was kind of slow, for sure. Kind of, kind of slow in the beginning. I think we reached like about three hours, and then we were still talking about shops and stuff. I think was it three hours or two hours? But yeah, the the beginning was kind of slow. I'm not gonna lie, JRPG beginnings are very slow, right? Yeah, JRPG beginnings are slow, but in this game in particular. This game is not a big game, so... Like, it's kind of like a filler game anyways, right? So they shouldn't have made it uh, longer, I guess. The opening, the opening of it, and a lot of tutorials, right? I wish it, wa it was not that long. I wish there was action much faster. But it's not really a big deal, I'm just saying. And I wish this game had uh, voice acting as well. That's it. That's it. That's it for me. So you failed to secure the primal rune lens. Oh, hurt swine. Also, this is hurt swine. Okay, I didn't see the name earlier. I can only offer my apologies, mighty ducks. We have secured a uh, rune lenses and draw and raw lenses, but the largest one, the supposed primal lens, has been destroyed. In addition, the room in which the lens was found appears to have caved in as a result of the power release and the sigil's destruction. It would appear that we were underestimated the adventurers, or at least some of them. I take full responsibility. Mighty, mighty ducks. The vault lies with me. I expected too much of you. If I may. You may not. My lord, I just... Hurstwine? You obey me and not your own selfish whims. whims. Leave. This world is not the one I want, but it will be. Are we gonna see that guy? Critical mastery received. Oh, okay. So we got some post, uh, post game stuff. Yeah, but I'll not do that. Okay. So yes, we're done. We finished the game. So we're gonna do the next game as well. Aiden Chronicles: uh, Hundred Heroes. Honestly, I'm much more excited for that one, right? But I'm, I'm excited as well because I want to see 
the characters in this one to appear in that one. So in 100 Heroes, I think the main main protagonist is going to be a different character. I guess not introduced in this one. Because I, I yeah I saw the... What do you call that? That art for that game. So there are a lot of different characters. And hopefully our characters here appear in that one as well, right? Especially CJ, Isha, Garu. I can't wait to see them again in the next game or yeah, in the yeah let's say the ne let's say the next next game next game because this is a full game still even though it was short right can't wait for that and yeah i just want to say thank you if you're watching this check out this video for some reason no matter when where yeah i just want to say thank you very much and hopefully you join me as well uh, when i play aiden a chronicle 100 heroes so I guess I'll see you when we start that game. So for now, bye-bye.